Hello everyone! I hope you are doing well at the beginning of autumn. Here is what I wore last week when the temperatures were mild between 13 and 16 degrees Celsius, with a peak at 20 degrees one day. Exceptional! And you, are you lucky with the weather? Let's start with Monday, shall we? A classic feminine silhouette with a rock and roll touch. Usually on Mondays, I'm full of energy. In the morning, I can wear medialed boots that I change in the afternoon for a pair of sneakers. Since the air has changed, I wear a very thin thermal under my cardigan. By the way, this cardigan contains wool. It is thin but warm. If you have been following me from the beginning, you know how much I hate wearing tights. And I am testing different brands of tights. I borrowed this leather jacket from my mother's wardrobe. She is very happy that I like her clothes. I find it a bit big for her and for me too. Today, a total burgundy look. You already know my viscose satin maxi skirt. I've had it since last year. I paired it with a light sweater. I really like this type of sweater that goes with everything. I made a video about it. Here is the link. Under the sweater, I wear a bodysuit because the weather is constantly changing. It's milder than yesterday, but at the end of the day, it will certainly be colder. I put on leather ankle boots, neither too high nor too fragile. I have a hard time buying new shoes in winter because I like the comfort of my old shoes. That's why I always wear the same shoes. Today, I need an outfit that I would compare to a blank page or a blackboard. An outfit that doesn't attract attention and that allows me to focus on what I have to do. When I wear black, I absolutely have to add touches of color. Otherwise, I feel like it lacks spice. I wear a simple warm sweater with viscose and wool crepe tailored pants with a thin leather belt, a pair of suede ankle boots, some gold jewelry and a natural colored leather bag. To finish the look, my butter yellow cropped trench coat. It's a little oversized and its color is quite timeless. Like a neutral color, it goes with everything. It adds a touch of fantasy to a rather classic and simple outfit. What do you think? Tell me in the comments below. If you like this video, like, comment and share. And if you really like all my other videos, subscribe. It's free and fun. Thank you. This Thursday, in contrast to my outfit from yesterday, I need light colors. I paired a sky blue sweater with a black and white skirt and dark brown velvet jacket. The sky blue color brings a touch of cheerfulness. The thermal must be tied with a scooped collar to be invisible under the sweater. In fact, I would say that you have to choose your thermals according to the sweaters you wear. Would you be interested in me updating the video on my winter essentials, the 2024 version? Tell me in the comments below the video. When it comes to fall and winter, I am more and more interested in details that bring comfort. 
I completed the set with this little brown bag and a long grey trench coat that I forgot to film. Because, finally, it is colder than I thought. For my outfit today, I created a dialogue between this neutral color palette and the neon yellow. My sweater is wool, but soft, and its color matches perfectly with my complexion, skirt, and clutch. The neon yellow makes the whole thing brighter and more voluble. I'm a creative, so I might as well express it in my clothes. I'm having fun. In my opinion, there is nothing worse than trying too hard to be chic. Compose your silhouettes, and sometimes the result will be chic without you trying to be. I hope that makes sense. Lol. <laughs> the leather jacket makes all the difference. It structures and finishes the outfit perfectly. I feel comfortable and confident, ready to face this long day. This outfit makes me happy. As the weather is exceptional this afternoon, around 20 degrees Celsius, no tights today for me. I go out for a drink with a friend. I chose my top colored mules. I haven't had much opportunity to wear them this year. So I take advantage of this incredible weather. This sequined skirt will sparkle in the sun. The burgundy sweater also works very well with the butter yellow cropped trench coat. As you can see, I wear as many colors as I want. My advice, forget this internet rule of three colors and treat yourself. The temperature has dropped to avoid having a silhouette that it is too shapeless, I put on my dark brown velvet jacket. I like simple but not basic outfits. And accessories are always a good way to highlight a silhouette. If you stayed this far, congratulations. If you haven't already, subscribe and activate the notification bell to be informed of each new video. And of course, see you in the next one!